Hello there, everybody. This is the third in our series of proven strategies to help you help yourself with back pain at home. I'm Dr. Jack Bielitz, a chiropractor. It's what we specialize in. So this one is for posture. Posture is very huge important in back pain. And so when you are standing, what you want to do is you want to have your feet about shoulder width apart. When you turn sideways, a lot of people say you should put your shoulders back, but that doesn't really do it because you can be in this posture and have, still have your shoulders back. What I want you to think about is putting that chest up, all right? When you pull your chest up, it automatically takes your shoulders back, but it also helps create a curve in that low back when you're just kind of reaching that chest up. And that curve back there is really important. By pushing your chest up, it also keeps your head up, which helps accentuate the curve that's in your neck. So that's the perfect way to do standing. Sitting is a whole nother story. Now let's face it, many of us will sit hours and hours at a desk, either all day, either on the computer or at work, whatever. So that's a very important thing. So when you're sitting, you wanna make sure your chair height is such that your thighs are parallel to the ground and your feet are sitting nicely on the floor. Then, when you get into your desk, you want to make sure again your chest is going up because that way you'll accentuate again that curve in your back. Now everybody's got different seats. If you have an executive type seat, you might have to sit farther forward than the back would normally allow because you've got to make sure that these feet or these legs are in this position. You have a right angle at your knees. Um, and if you sit back on some executive chairs, you might not be able to do that. If you're in more of a secretarial chair, that is a much better chair. I much prefer a secretarial chair such as this, where it's got, where the area of this is a little bit shorter so that I can sit all the way in the back and still have my legs reaching properly. The next thing you want to think about is your computer. For some people, their computer is off to the side and they have to look down. That takes that curve out of the neck. What you want to do is you want to have your monitor in front of you if possible, and you might have to put a couple of books or something so that your monitor can stand up so you're looking straight ahead, keeping that neck curve in place. And it's also really great when you can have a desk height where your forearms are basically parallel to the ground, kind of like your thighs were. So this desk is almost perfect. It's a little bit high if I had a keyboard here, but so I would probably change that a little bit. I might raise my chair up a little bit because that way my arms are kind of more parallel. It takes a lot of the pressure off those shoulders and allows me to keep that posture easier rather than my arms dragging me down. Okay, I really hope this was a good help to you. Posture, huge importance. If we can help you at all, 402-333-4848. Stay healthy, Omaha.